Thanks for tuning in to PLP TV. We're looking at the HTL pipettes today. One of the lightest units on the market itself and the action really good. And I just want to show a bit of what we can do with a set of scales here and the amount of force that is required. So let's get these scales. It only requires about 0 0.25 Newton or 250 grams of force on these scales to get to the first stop. Perhaps you want to test your current pipettes on a set of scales and you'll have an idea of how light this pipette's action really is. Now, even the injection, when I put a tip on, is really quite light as well. So, how am I going to test that on this? Um, ah, Alberto, uh, the, the, the DVD stack, man, can you bring that over? Cheers, mate. Well, let's get rid of these for a moment. Okay. Tear. We're not showing you everything here, but you'll have to take my word that repeating the test with a tip on a 20 microliter pipette, we got between 950 and 1400 millinewtons of force required for ejection. Quite impressive, really. I think you'll find it quite difficult to find anything just like this on the market as far as softness of action. Now, tips is another thing that you're quite often concerned about. We sell at PLP the oxygen tips. So, oxygen brand, universal tips, yeah. The units also come with a volume lock, so I pull up to change my volume. And HTL actually have taken into consideration the amount of turns that it takes, and it's not really many, to get down to my smallest volume here. You push down to lock the volume, though if you forget, you just have to start using the pipette and it will lock anyway. These pipettes are also autoclavable and they're calibratable as well if you have a micro balance. There's a locking mechanism which you insert here and you flick up to stop it from slipping calibration and then you remove the cap here and then adjust if you need to. It's all in the instructions that you get with the pipettes. The HTL pipette range also, as you can see here on the rack, comes in an 8 as well as 12 channel pipette. The rack here is available. It comes First of all, you can buy the kit with the P1000, 200, 20 and P10 and you get the rack as well as an entire kit, just like this. Now the rack itself, you can buy on its own and it's actually compatible with your current pipettes. So if you only need one or two HCLs and you already have some other size pipettes, you can buy the HCL rack and it probably is compatible. You just have to check the details available online. Now as far as price, these things are really competitive on the market and if that's not good enough for you, Please let us know, we'll see what we can do for you. Okay, so what are the caveats? As I've been demoing these, I've found that those with medium and large hands find the unit very comfortable. Now while HGL do say they have designed the Discovery Pros with all hand sizes in mind, I think most users who have small hands would prefer a smaller girth in their pipettes, such as found in PLP's LabNet by pipette range. Now that sums up this video on the HGL pipettes. Please uh, let us know and we can see what we can do to try and get one of these into your hands for you to do a trial. Thanks for tuning in. If you'd like any more information on this or any of our other great products, please check our website at www.pacificlab.com.au. Thanks for tuning in.